Welcome to Cynthia Porter's studio. I'm Cindy and this is my exploration into art. Thanks for being here. Hey gang, so I wanted to keep it fairly simple this week because I had the brood uh, spayed and neutered on Wednesday. So it's been a pretty busy week for me and then I got a little bit of a stomach bug. Speaking of bugs, let me get you Chaz. Now I'm going to start off, I've got a little bit of titanium white and that is by, let me see, I think that was that Liquitex. And then we have a Brilliant Blue by Liquitex. And I'm also going to be using um, a Deep Magenta by Liquitex, and this is their soft body paint. And then I'm going to use some 24 karat gold, some Cadmium Yellow Light. And what else have I not mentioned? Hmm. I think that's about it. Anyways. So I wanted to go with a lot of negative space and minimal paint and I'm going to use my straw and blow y'all out something. Now what I'm going to be blowing you out is Chaz and he is the coolest bug, speaking of bugs. <laughs> He's a termite. You know, termites um, occasionally will sprout their wings and fly. So that's, he's a flyer for sure. And he started out, he was living above uh, Kaz Walker's place in Tennessee. And Kaz is who discovered Dolly Parton before she went to Nashville. Anyways, Chaz didn't care too much for country music. So he ended up going all the way to California and hanging out the, at the uh, Whiskey A Go Go in the basement. Basement? No, he didn't live in the basement. He lived in the attic. So, he is very colorful, and he loves a good beat. You know, Chaz is the single reason why most recording artists tie scars onto their microphones. I want to give a special shout out to my girls Joanne and Janet, and a special thank you to Lori for being here with us. If you haven't caught them, their links are all in my description. Be sure to go ahead and hit that thumbs up, and if you're not subscribed, please do. I'd greatly appreciate it. And if you have any questions about a technique or color, just ask me in the comments, and I'll be sure to get back with you. Love y'all! As I'm applying my paint, I'm putting it into really thin layers into the funnel and I'm making sure that my funnel stays below the titanium white because you want your paint to go underneath the white, not on top of it.
In Fluid Art, we create a lot of air bubbles when we mix our paint. And to resolve that, we use a torch, not on the paint, just right over it, to bring those bubbles up and make them pop. If we don't do that, then when our paint dries, it'll look like it has a bad case of acne. trying to work on Chaz's manners but he is a messy eater and he doesn't eat wood he likes corn <laughs>
take my palette knife and I'm going to go around the edges of my canvas and scrape any drips because you don't want drips because they will change the composition that you have on top. Also, I'm giving it a once over and making sure that I'm happy with my piece. And when I'm doing all that tilting, I'm making sure that there's not too much paint on the canvas. Chaz is here to tell you there's a lot more beautiful bugs out there than just butterflies and ladybugs. Speaking of ladybugs, he's got to fly on over and meet up with his girlfriend for tonight's party. I hope y'all have enjoyed myself and the other ladies in this collaboration. And I'm going to send you guys over to my beautiful and wonderful and sweet friend Donna. So head on over there and I'll see you guys next week. This is Cindy wishing y'all a bunch of peace, love, light, and lots and lots of laughter. And I'll see y'all next week. Love y'all. Bye-bye.